Hey. Hey, all you cool cats and dogs out there. You're listening to K92FM. The Vivo. Boy, I wish that Hey, sorry, that's my that's my slack. Let me, let me turn off slack real quick. Hey. Hey. Doing tired, but okay. Bought a new PC monitor stuff today. Gotta get it tomorrow. That's neat. Nice. I just kinda laid on my bed for like two hours just before this. It's kind of how, like, YouTube auto-playing. That's the kind of mood I'm in. <laughs> That's a mood. <laughs> uh, I was like, ah, I want to stream. Whoa. Well, we got a, we got a screen. What's, what's the, what's the, what are those called? Screen grabs. Yeah, there's some sick low poly aesthetic going on. Eye catchers? Yeah, that's probably, I think that's it. Got some spooky things. Okay, so this, that little section right there, the going through the beds, that was all I've seen. I, I saw, I watched like maybe five minutes of this game. Holy smokes, that's loud for me. Oh, is that very loud for you guys? <laughs> it's loudish, but not too bad. Okay, so I think I think I just have the audio cranked up in my head, which I should, because it's spooky game time. Um, the game should be changed. Or the title should be changed. I don't know why it's not. Well, let me change it. It looks like it did an update. I did it all already, but hang on. First playthrough. Update. There we go. Hopefully now it's updated. This game contains violent images and flashing lights. Um, is it is it just not updating? Why is it not updating? Twitch, what the heck? I just did it again. Update. Title updated? Thank you. I, I like just went to check on my end and it still says Dark Souls. That is real frustrating Twitch. There we go. Cool. Um so yeah, uh I only saw a little bit of this game. Uh I I know very little, but it 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 immediately was like, I'm I'm buying this. Like I'm super intrigued. Um so yeah. It looked real good and spooky. Um, and I wanted to share with y'all. Slightly harder to hear me? Okay, hang on. How about we do this? What if I... Boost myself up a little bit. And I'll bring down the game just a little bit. So it's not too terribly loud for you guys. Okay. Um, 
Why don't, why don't I just get into this, y'all? Got your lights turned off? You ready to be scared? Are you ready for a scare? To terrorize your neighborhood. Though I know I should be wary, still I venture someplace scary. Okay, let's play. <laughs> Continue? I haven't played though. So how are you feeling? <clears throat> Do you feel these sessions are still helping? You could try something a little more... Direct. We could start in vivo exposure therapy. Vivo exposure therapy. Is that an actual thing? Does anyone know if that's an actual thing? Oh, it's a doggy. Come this way, doggy. He doesn't want to. Okay. He's going for a nice walk, chat. Bebo exposure. Spook us good? Alright. I mean, from... The little bit I watched, I was like, yo, I'm in. I'm ready. This will not end well for the dog. Nah, dog's fine. He's a helper dog. He's got a little, uh, one of those vests. A little rain, a little bit of rain. A game by Akuma Kira. It's got a title sequence. You know it's good. That's like one of my things. <laughs> one of my things. One of my favorite things game do is when they have a little title sequence that plays out. I don't know. I just like it. Can one pet the dog? Can I pet? I can whistle. What if there was just like one figure in one of those windows staring? But only like... Only if you're not paying attention. As soon as you look, it, it goes away. Now this dog don't care. This dog is on a mission to, to get me to where I need to be. This dog's doing its job. Shocking illegal experiments. Or a man gone insane. Secret gout. Secret government test, not gout. <laughs> Dr. B leaks the info. Good for Dr. B. Unless Dr. B was behind it all. And he's just trying to get some, like, witness protection thing. Jeez, man, we picked a shitty time to go for walks. I love this little, like, uh, like pixelated lens flare we got going on right here. You can see, like, when I'm looking through the light. I love that. Okay, I'm coming. This is the whole game? Yeah. You know, I'm okay with that. I thought I saw something behind <laughs> Mothman in three, two, one. Man, I got a I got a quick turning radius on this mouse. Are there any good Mothman games? Fallout seventy six, I guess. I don't know. I know Mothman's like supposedly in that. That's all I actually know. <laughs> you would think. Oh no. No. No! Get him! Save him! We're just... We, I just gotta find my dog. Press F. Now I know I, we can whistle.
Hungry Demon. My madness works. Look, it's um, Undertale. Merlin the Great Wizard. The Snatcher. Hot Cross Demons. Okay. Mule Bunny. Project MQ. I wonder if those were like people who helped with the game or something. Victor E.G. <gasps> I hear him! Puppy! Lorenzo Jr. <gasps> I hear him. I love low poly. It, like, it's just great. <clears throat> I, I, I feel like... I feel like it's the equivalent of like... NES pixel graphics where like your imagination kind of plays with it. So I think it works perfect for horror. Hmm, green. Would you guys do this? If your puppy fell down a drain? Low poly textures are basically Pixar. art. Exactly. Oh, there's the radio. Stelius Llama. Press I to check inventory. Oh, this is great. Game manual. Sprint, use E. Whistle, space, flashlight, F, reload, R. Check map, M. Change weapon, mouse, wheel, Q. Attack, left mouse, block, right mouse. Inventory, pause, escape. Torn leash. My dog's leash. It got torn in the broken sewer grate. Key ring. All the key rings that I have all the Look at the little puppies on there. DOS tape number one. An old tape I found at home. I should find a tape player. I should listen to it. The pound is written on it. Can I get this? Yes! Yes! Now we're, now we're playing a video game. I hear him. He's okay, chat. Puppy's okay. <whistles> Sounded like this way. Puppy? What's Puppy's name? Hang on, I'm gonna go back for that. Frip. Gurp. <laughs> oh, that's good. Don't be whistling back at me. Stage select! Hey! I'm gonna turn it up for me. So it's gonna get scary loud in my ear. It's already spooky in here. Thank you for the sub. Mmm! 
There's not much on TV nowadays, so I thought I'd make my own show. I started putting food and rancid meat in the useless old box, and all sorts of little critters would come and play. It was really relaxing to just sit on the sofa and watch them eat, but the smaller critters started attacking, attracting larger ones to the show. Some horrid, putrid thing came by looking to watch, so I would just pretend to be asleep till it passed, but I think it knows I'm awake. I think it's watching me, not the show on TV. Yeah, okay, that's... Mmm. Uh, Meat and donut. And pizza. My favorite show. <laughs> Professor Farnsworth, good news, everyone. <laughs> I can't do a Professor Farnsworth. <laughs> To shred, you say. That's my favorite line. I think for the sub. Hey, nice, uh, nice founder's badge there. <laughs> Ooh, more notes. My eyes are useless. All they can do now is sting and show me stuff that can't be real. If that rancid thing wants them, then I say let them have them. You just... F Did he take his eyes out? So crazy sewer guy gave his eyes to a rancid meat creature. That's good. This is good. I'm not hearing any more barks. Oh. Oh, hey. I guess this was blind guy. What? I thought his, like, head just came off. Gotta really check it out. They're dead. <clears throat> I just... I murdered a man. Sorry. I'm just trying to find my dog. Yo, he's a pretty good artist. Doing that with no eyes. Hello? <gasps> Puppy! No! Oh, no! <laughs> Why would you do that? Why would you do that to me? I can't go in there. It's too small. Hmm. It's getting some uh, good sounds here. Some good m meaty sounds. Wet meat. Yeah, the slow music build is very good. Oh, hey. Why did that just turn off automatically? That was not me, chat. I was like, I thought I suddenly ran out of batteries or something. Wait, do we have batteries? The batteries are long-lasting and hard. And had guaranteed to last all game written on the package, whatever that means. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, game. All hope abandoned ye who enter here. Okay. Okay. No more puppy bark.
Yeah, it was it was more of just like a graffiti artist, just like, oh, these are cool words. It wasn't very uh, threatening. Maybe that's how they get you, though. Um, okay, well, let's, let's just keep moving. Let's just keep moving! Let's just keep moving! Oh, okay, we just get... Just some... Just a demon hole. You coming? Oh, we're... I, I guess we're going down here. Would you do this for the dog, chat? Would you still be going for the dog? Nope, nope. <laughs> A lot of people abandoning the dog pretty quick. <laughs> you know, you're, you guys are totally fair, because, you know, I don't, I don't think I'd go this far. I also murdered a man. Granted, he, he, he had a, what I assume was a weapon. I'm not getting any more, uh, any more barks. Yeah, let's just go the other way. Let's just go the other way, chat. <clears throat> coming out later. Nah, I know, I know. There's no way they're getting out. Those bars are solid. Oof. See? Chat, the bars are solid. Everything's fine. <laughs> Everything's fine. This is the undead asylum, yeah. We're about to go fight uh, the uh, asylum demon. Or, according to last night, we're gonna go fight the gargoyles. Easy to get lost in these demon pipes. Oh, I think I, I think I heard a vague bark sound. A bark-like noise. Okay, hang on. What just happened? Some Symphony of the Night, uh, save room. Okay. We saved. Game saved. What? 
my my dog though. The pup was a lie. The pup was a lie, Jack. Oh, is this the corridor that I was about to go down that I didn't? Nope. Because now this is a room. Bill stickers. Well, we missed whatever was back in that other pathway. Hopefully uh, not an important meat note. Josh Boschel. Lady Dragonia. Dragon Killer. Nonstop Disco. Chatty Whacker. Alf Kid. EB Agent J. Can I have food? Trash. No. Well, that show looks good. Coming. <laughs> the rise of spooks. Oh, is this the same folks who did a... Uh Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Okay, so that's where he came in. Things down. Locked. Can't go that way. No puppy. Fucking, what is this? What is, puppy? Is that what I look like? Did he just? <laughs> Dog nappers. Train office key. Bloated, disgust, fat, gross. Cool. Spooky. Can I go in tracks? No. <laughs> Damaged handgun pickup. Wow, I'm glad I checked this trash. I thought I could pick up the cups. I need to interact with more stuff. The trick to stop all eating. Diet. Oh, is that what that other poster is? Serial pillock. John Wayne Lane. <laughs> Mind the gap. Does this auto open? Hey, good. I'm always annoyed when um, games make you pull out the key. Like the specific key. I guess I get it, but it's also like, come on. Yes? We're playing Atari now? I want to check desk. Okay. Mm, these door. Okay. No. no. Uh, no. Just auto closing. Jeez, I spooked myself. <laughs> Who's conducting the train? What I want to know is who's the sheriff?
Oh. What just happened? Do we hit someone? Uh, I see. I want to make a decision. I want control back in my life. I want it to matter. Everyone just makes choices for me. Maybe I'll find some place where I can be happy. Some place dark without people to remind me how ugly I am. I'm sorry. Mmm. Whoa. Oh. Mystical tape player. That whistle did sound kind of like a cat call. <laughs> oh, we're like VHS. I think this is close. Oh, I don't have, I don't have a flashlight. I don't have inventory. I think this was around when I was, uh, I tuned in. What is... <laughs> Jesus! So this tape was called The Pound. Dogs, little dog. Bolt cutters. Can I free dogs? No? Can I free my dog? Is this my dog? He doesn't have the service thing. Oh, okay. Deep fried dog. Hey, I'll go in that room in just a second. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything else. Like a, a handgun. I mean, it's... Okay, so is the one with the light. I don't know if that's going to be a universal thing. An old game called Midnight. Where? Oh. 
Oh, for the race station. See you there. Old game. Feeling old, chat? PlayStation X. Oh, map. Cute girl. Imagine the dream. I'm imagining it, chat. PlayStation, PlayStation Cross. Excuse me. You're, you're right. Donuts. Key. Metro key. Ooh, gross donuts. The whole station is just broken. Lines are run backwards. Access panels are hard to get to. And sometimes the power just cuts. Since this is considered a bad part of town, the funding for the station was minimal and most of the construction was done by local residents. To top it off, the last maintenance guy messed up everything. He told me when he left to keep every light on and either redirect or send off any trains that arrived. I made several attempts to fix the electrical problems, but it's so bad I don't think I'm getting anywhere. So I'm leaving. This job just isn't worth the hassle anymore. I keep thinking space is interact. If the power goes out of the tracks, you have to reboot the whole system. In order to do that, to go... Go to each section and turn off the breaker boxes, then come back here and restart the system. I've barely been able to keep the power on, so that's all the advice besides quitting I can give. Huh. Okay, so I have to go to turn off a bunch of other things, I guess. Moldy donuts. This is our save room. Um, my dog is lost. I went into the sewers. Um, and then something happened. And now I'm here. <laughs> there were there were some gross uh things. Hey, it's my dog. Eric found my dog. Thank you. Ariel Wolf. Cat Kate. I want my dog now at Silent Hill. That's a pretty good uh, DJ. AJ! Oh, also, can we look at that? Um, damage gun, damage gun. I wonder what it's doing down here. Okay, a lot of, uh... Diet-related things, except for the show Coming. I know you think it says Coming October or something? No, but don't. the name is Coming, and it's just saying it's in October. <laughs> That'd be a terrible day for a show. Restrooms. Guys, want to go to the restrooms in a uh, rundown train station? <gasps> Yo, that is some thick toilet paper. Never mind. It's really thin. <laughs> I thought it was, I thought it was like an actual rectangle. Oh, I don't know what to do. I'm not happy. I'm so ugly and everyone treats me like I'm not even real. They're so pretty and perfect and they all have friends, but I'm just here. Hey, note, okay? I'm trying to play a video game. Mad Myrtle. Isn't, ooh. Yeah, yeah. I'm with you, game. P 
puddle of mud. Ruger Amber picked up. I heard a noise over here. Zombie DJ. Huh. Weird. It's in the trash? Nope. Okay. Just a spooky noise. Can I shoot that gun? Hang on. Huh. It seems like I can. Walrus wear! Hey, thanks for stopping by. Good to see ya. Broken. Broken? These all don't have doorknobs. Oh, there's the power. Okay, I want to check the other thing. It was a slow train. It was a slow day when it happened. Only two trains even stopped here. I didn't see her until it was too late. I heard her sobbing as she walked down the tracks. I wanted to run and save her, but I could hear the train. I just waited and listened. She must have regretted it at the last moment because I heard her scream. I can't stop her. She passes through the walls. All I can do is wait and listen. I was following you in the first half. Okay. I'm going to go check the other room. Ghosts. Okay. Cause I think this was the last door. Yep. I'm like all paranoid about finding weapons now after we've picked up that pistol. I want to test it, but I don't want to test it. I don't like this. I changed my mind. Oh, hey! Oh, okay. We're moving! I guess that's the, uh, wait and listen. Okay. Am I safe? I like this little first person. Okay. So, that's, I guess, one. I, I did this one, right? Uh, which one do we come from? It was, I think it was this left one here is where I came from. Okay. Yeah, because the light's not on in here. There's a light there, right? Yep, okay. I need some ammo, please. Oh, this one's dark. Never mind. <laughs> I don't want to go in the train tracks. I don't want to go 
about the strange accent. Right, let me up. Let me up. Not yet. Oh, there's a train there. Oh, it looks like maybe you go on train? <gasps> I see shiny. I see a shiny. Shotgun. Oh. Seven bullets. Okay. Should I run down the train track, guys? Do I have a map? Um, hang on. I'm going to go run down the train tracks. That's a terrible statement to make. I changed my mind about this. I just wanted ammo. Oh. Okay. I got it. Got it. I got it, game. Don't go down the train tracks. Okay, don't. Um, all right. What all did we look at? This was just the, the game. <clears throat> the key. I just wanted the souls. <laughs> Uh, I think this is before we found those extra bullets because they were in the bathroom, I think. Read note. It's not going to go in the train tracks anymore. Okay. So this way... Rest rooms. There's like a note in one of these. And then what happened here? Okay. Just making sure we're doing everything. I got the ammo. Did I go in this room? Yeah. This was the room we need to go in. Feed us from PT. Seriously. Nope. Nope. Don't need to waste bullets if I'm too fast. A guy kills his family one time. Gosh. <laughs> Terrible.
Okay, let's go get our shotgun. Also, that train was about to hit this train, so, you know. <laughs> you know, chat. I just, I kind of feel safe having the shotgun out. Nothing that way. How American of me. Ugh. Tape two. What is that? I don't know, game. What is it? There's only one book here. The Miracles of Business. Hold up. Okay, that's where I came in. I'm trying to remember backtracking since we gotta run. Here, here, just to be un-American, anti-gun, I'll oh, use the sledgehammer <laughs> until we have one ounce of threat, and then I'll immediately switch back. Mmm. Key. Need a key. Broken. Ammo? Ammo? Cool. Broken? Yes. Ooh, lock picks. Pick lock sec. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So not a key. We make our own keys here, chat. A lot of books on subway utilities. A few books about locksmithing. Give me the locksmithing ones, please. Plant. I wonder if it has a minigame. I don't know. Okay, that was the ammo. I have to hold it. Mm. I don't like that. We're going. Oh, God. Come on! <laughs> Anytime, game. Gee, what? Gee, 
Jesus. Wrong room. Oh god, I forgot about this. No, I don't want to waste bullets. I don't want to waste bullets. Whew. Health 100. Flawless, chat. Okay, uh, let's save. I think it's this far left. It looks like we have one more to do. Also, we got another tape. So let's save and do the tape and then save again and then stop playing. No, just kidding. <laughs> Lost tape two. First try. I like these tapes a lot. Really cool atmosphere. Oh, I didn't read what this one was called. That's cool. I think it was <clears throat> I think it was going between am I sick and I'm not sick, which is uh terrifying. I don't know, that whole idea, like... Of just not knowing. Like, I don't know if you guys have watched the show I worked on, Undone. There's a lot of like, mental health issue stuff in that. That stuff always scares me. Because it's, like, too real and, like, too... Like, you can't imagine it because when it's always presented, it's, like... Just the real world for that, you know, character or whatever. So how do you... How do you argue against something that you think is, like, the real world? Or, like, proven factual happening in front of you and it's not like that's that's was roto using that or just reference roto it was rotoscope animation and it's on amazon prime which way do we go blue or 
orange. I feel like orange is more threatening. Wait, didn't we already have Let Me Up? I just made a loop, didn't I? These monitors aren't telling me anything. Really, I really like that effect. I don't like this sound that's slowly building. Oh, more tunnels. I can still whistle for dog in this whatever this uh, is. Going down, going down. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hey, hey friends. <laughs> hey, it's me. I'm gonna save again. Think I broke my legs? Yeah, I probably couldn't move. At least I couldn't move fast. All right, one more chamber to do. Yeah, I think this section was where I, I tuned in, in this train area. Yeah, a lot of, like... I, I like this, it's just, like, unsettling enough to, like, kind of make you on edge with, like, thinking. I like that. I like that a lot more in horror. Like, psychological horror, I feel, is more impactful. A few books about customer service. Can I go through this? Yes. Gotta get our dog back. We gotta get our dog back, chat. Should I check that other room first? No map of this area. Is the power switch going to be at the end of this? This is going to suck. How many of those do I have?
I wonder if those are not going to work because the power is out. Oh, so you would have had to do this lock. If you didn't check this back route first, <clears throat> you would have had to open that. Because the power is going to go out and it's not going to let us use those. I bet. I bet you. Yep. Knew it. Wasted one bullet. Well, I mean, didn't waste it, but we used one bullet. I think that's all the power. Uh, apparently the power system for this terminal is like dependent on shutting off the other powers to restore power to this section. Why? I don't really know. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna save. Okay, so can we do this now? Neat. What? Okay. Well, that sound was fucking terrifying. <laughs> oh, this train's all gross. Dead rat. He makes me feel so much better sometimes, but I worry that I'm not good enough. He wants me to lose weight, and I'm really trying. But it's just so difficult. I look in the mirror and nothing's changed. This uh, section is very that... <clears throat> Willy Wonka. Where the lights? I keep getting scared by the sound of the doors closing. Nice, light-hearted, fun horror game. Can I get out now? Oh. Oh. No, no. Oh, that's trippy. Well, last time I was on the train tracks, bad things happened. I would like to not be on the train tracks, please. Here we go. Whoa. Look at this fancy train station. 
Grand Bulimav. Bulimia? Is that what we're going with? I'm assuming. Or am I looking too much into that? Save. Royal Phantom Construction. So it looks like going down the train tracks actually has a thing to that room over there. Okay, might as well explore this area first, though. Stream keeps freezing. Dang. Whoa. A little bit of blood coming from that light. It's a little goopy. Okay. Not terrifying at all. Okay. <laughs> Is that room in Dranglet Castle? <laughs> um, just a sack of something. Sack of potatoes. Did I just get flipped? No, this is the way we haven't gone in. It won't open. It's covered in some kind of slime. This slime? I didn't want to step on it. Okay, so... We went in... Wait, was there, was there another chamber there that I missed? Yeah, this. Jeez, I walked right past this. Pick up. The door feels hot. Why am I moving so slow? Can I cover? Uh, am I dead? Did I die? I died. <clears throat> it's fun. I slipped and poured boiling acid on myself. G you? What? Okay. What was I supposed to do with the acid stuff then? Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared me. Seventy-nine. My health is that. Mirrors were the enemy, guys. Is this me? Is this me? Gross. Disgusting. I'm so ugly. I'm so disgusting. I see what you're doing. No one wants me. Gross. I see what's going on. I see, I see. Okay, so that was... An, an intentional death. Hmm. 
Man, that thing just like drives into you. They're so fast. Mirrors are so fast, chat. No one told me. Gross is one of my like favorite words. I I just love <laughs> it's it just like so much emotion from one word, gross. I love it. Train. Life was too harsh. Love was lost forevermore. They hung from the ceiling fan, staring at the floor. Uh, um... Jesus! What the fuck? That was good. That was good. You got me, game. You got me. No, what if, what if you don't? What if you don't, though? Oh, Jesus. It's like a mouse. That's cool as shit. Yeah, that one hurt me. Where the hell is... Did I just like walk past it? Yes, I did, chat. Something just unlocked, and I don't like that. I don't like when door noises happen. When I haven't done anything. Get my shotgun out. Spooky restrooms. I don't know what to write. I'm not sure if it's good or bad. I don't know if what makes me happy or sad. I think we're going to have a child. Parenting tip number one from your boy Dan Jones. Don't start... Like this. <laughs> Life was too harsh, and a bridge was close by. They sank in the water, gaping for the sky. Would have assumed it was gasping for this guy. Ooh, ooh, some, some rat. New Pokemon Choo Choo. That is very good. Why are we fighting meat trains? <laughs> Choo Choo is very good. He he chew and he also chew. Bloody. 
Am I going to get spooked? Oh, ew. I got a knife. It was a trick or a treat. <clears throat> I, for one, am not too interested in Dynamaxing, says MD. Let me tell you about my opinions. I hate it. It's stupid. It sucks. What do you think in Pokemon? <laughs> I don't, I don't want to get into it now because I'm just going to rant. Uh, but super not a fan of Dynamaxing. If anything, it's just made me want to buy the game less. Broken. Wait, so that was that all that was over here? Bathroom? Oh, wait, we had that one. Oh, shit. Gaping for the sky. I think that was a puzzle. What was it a girl's restroom? There was those three heads. And we said page one and page two. I don't know what to write. Not sure good about it. I think we're going to have a child. Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Because one of these said page two. Life was too harsh and a bridge was close by. They sing. So he's got to be like facing up. That's what I'm assuming here. Because there's nowhere else to go right now. There wasn't like another puzzle, was there? Maybe the child one's looking down because they're like, mm. I have a child. I feel like knife's got to be good since we just got knife, right? Jesus, that is a nightmare. Knife is not good. Knife sucked. I think Sledgehammer was better. I haven't tried Shotgun. Okay, so hang on. This is barricade. Okay. Wait, there might be mirrors. It's just me. Just me. It's a pile of me. Just checking. Okay, so maybe... Like... Oh! 
Uh-oh. With a sideways stare. Okay, so three. Which one's three? Do you think this one's three or this one's three? Do you think it's one, two, three, or three, two, one? I would say it's one, two, three, right? So we know this... Shit. <laughs> I scared myself. Oh, I wonder if I need to reset it because I messed up. Oh, there's going to be mirrors out here, aren't there? No. What did I do? Did I do it right? I don't think I did it right. I think I'm gonna die. Don't do this to me, dog. I've moved on. I got a new dog. Hear him chat. He's alive. <whistles> this the dog whistle mechanic is amazing for like navigating these areas like that is a really cool idea feel about this tunnel it's awfully chunky As long as puppy's still okay, you know, we got to keep going. He's depending on us, chat. You don't want to let him down, do you? I'm not going to have to find this puppy and tell him chat didn't want to find this puppy. Chat abandoned the puppy. I love how with video games you can feel just as immersed as the game watching someone else play, playing yourself, sometimes even more. For sure. I feel like there's times where I'm watching games where I get I get a lot more that's going on in the game and just from watching it than playing it. Because I feel like, especially in horror, like I'll, I'm just too distracted by being scared at something that I'm not paying attention or or, or I just miss something that was a clear thing to pick up or whatnot. Oh god. What 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 is? G 
Jesus. These look knife worthy. Knife, good. Can't run out of ammo on a knife. No more dog. Oof. Getting low in health. Eighteen health. Are you kidding me? Oh, fuck you, game. I've recovered a little bit of health, chat. Save? Save. Where'd it go? Does it always disappear? I'm expecting the angel to do something every time. All he talks about is how ugly I become, how ugly I'm going to be. He tells me he's leaving. I feel so sick. He hates me now, and all I have this responsibility. All because of this parasite inside me. I didn't think this would happen. I just did what I was told. I wanted him to be happy. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, what if I don't move forward? What if I just don't go forward? Okay. Okay, what if I what if I just run? What if I just run? There's nothing. Waste all my ammo. Well, I guess I should. Well, oh, so how are you feeling? I feel like everyone hates me and I hate myself. Your sense of self worth is too influenced by body shape and weight. You don't judge others so harshly. You have worth, you have beauty, but you are unable to see it. Your vision of yourself is distorted. Then how should I fix it? If I can't fix my body, then how do I fix my vision of myself? We're working together to fix it. But I'll also write you a refill for your... Fluxing team. Was that a... Was I supposed to be dead? Or did I actually die? Oh, different. I was supposed to die. Is this because I'm on the drug now? Turn on. I want music. Which way, which way do you want to go, guys? 
pretty or ugly? I'm assuming. I feel like we're supposed to go pretty, right? Ugly. Left. Ugly. Let's go ugly. Okay, let's go, like, really ugly, <laughs> or really pretty. Let's get ugly. I feel like ugly, uh... I, I'm assuming that went smoothly. Is this a Stanley Parable? All the way ugly? Those eyes remind you of not drunk enough. Yo. Not drunk enough is so good. If you guys don't or haven't read Not Drunk Enough, go. Go read. Good webcomic. Great webcomic. Some free ammo. <gasps> we're getting it was we were pretty the whole time, chat. This was fake beauty. This is real. Raw ugly on the inside, chat. An apple. Is that a baby face? Is it meat? Are we going to have to eat this and then puke? Is that what's going on here? Eat. I want meat. Give me the meat. What if I don't? What if I just eat and leave? What if I don't want to make myself puke? I'm going to eat it and just not go by the toilet. Oh. Secrets. Maybe. More ammo. I'm taking that out as I was. We were really right, chat. We're all ugly. Eat fruit. Oh. Snacks are normal. What if we don't eat? Should I eat? Should I keep eating? Maybe... If we keep eating, that's the issue. That was the issue the whole time. Don't eat. I'm gonna not eat. Uh oh, it's red. Nah, we gotta keep going for. It. Oh God, there's a monster. <laughs> we made the wrong choice, chat. Eating's good. Eating is good for you. Eat the food. Eat the food. Yup. It wants us. It wants us. No. Go through bars. More ammo. Okay, so I think... What? Okay, so what's the dog? What's the dog then? Eat 
again. Still good. No ammo though. Yeah, this one looks like it's getting past an eating disorder or just body image. Okay, okay PT. You were sick of her. She came home late, smelling like booze, flirting with the neighbors, whatever he says. Oh, God! I didn't know, chat. I was curious. <laughs> I didn't even try to interact with it. <laughs> Did I just get, like, a bad end? Did I just get a bad end, chat? Listen, when, when PT has influenced you, you you gotta kill the baby. I'm sorry. Uh, can we... Can I go back? <laughs> the baby's fine! Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Here, here I come, for the first time through this hallway. Shit. So, so the girl with the eating disorder who was pregnant, she was the one who killed herself in the train. Puppy came through here. This poor dog. He's just being dragged. I didn't like the drag scene. The drag scene where he was just pulled away from me. That made me sad. Because his little ears went back. Are we in a small intestine? It definitely feels intestine-like. But I think it's supposed to be a cave now. I think we're just full in cave now. I waited in the dark for so long, I lashed out against anyone who got close, but someone kept pushing me into the light. It hurt for a while. It doesn't hurt anymore. I gotta stop catcalling all these letters. Oh shit, this music though. This is a bop and a half. I need three of a thing. Arrow. How about a save spot? There's a camera looking at me too. Of course I don't. More holes. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to hold off on the hole right now. The silhouette on the TV had previously been on the save door. 
Really? Oh, shit. Save. I don't want to hit any of those chains. We can't, we, I, we're so close to the outside. I already hit some of those chains, I guess. Okay. This way? Save. Also, you were totally right, Mizzo. Game saved. Because there's those little people. The place should be empty, but the lights are on. I keep hearing something crawling around. Why keep the power on? Why? I can't fathom why this place even is. I try to map it out, but it doesn't make sense. I, <laughs> I don't know why I think space is that. <laughs> Wait, did I try to go straight? Yes. Okay, so... into the hole. Here we go. Nothing creepy about this. I don't like how I can see that. X. I see. Puppy? Puppy! Puppy, you don't look so good. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay, puppy. Yeah, this place sucks. My opinion of this place is it sucks. I don't know why those little doors moved like that, but I, I'm going to imagine there's just death in those pits. If we shoot our dog out of paranoia, oh my god. Beetle emblem. Mine access key. Now we just got to go back, chat. Well, I tried. <laughs> Climb.
<sighs> maybe maybe this is like to cope with the loss of our dog. Maybe like he died back in um whatever uh like maybe he did fall down the drain. Wait a minute. I just made a loop. I don't like this loud sound coming from over here. Can I inviso? Bomb emblem. Thought it'd be safe down here. I'm so far away from those monsters up above, but even down here, I'm not alone. I think one of them saw me. Why are they dragged away? Nobody knows. Wait a minute. More? Tunnels. I hear him. Cooking adventure. Ooh. Okay, got to figure out a different way in there, I guess. Found it. I told everyone, but no, no one listens to me. I can't trust anyone. They're all serving the monsters. No one is different. It's just me now. Why wouldn't they just listen? Why, why every time do I not just hit E? 
like a dingus. I don't like how that's an X. I don't like how that's an X either. Ah, hang on, he's gonna catch me on the ladder. Damn, they do a lot of damage. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Go! Woo! What? The fuck was that? Oh gosh, man, the game so started to get me there. That climb was stressful. And now we're here. I never found a third or fourth tape. Man, I'm, I suck at exploring. Dr. Brundle, personal archive. Feeling good about today. Progress continues almost at an alarming rate, given how theoretical all this should be. Today we had one of the smaller rodents continue to move for about two hours after all of the blood had been drained and replaced with a mix of that. Okay. False, I'm great at exploring. Wonder what happened if I didn't kill that baby. I don't like this. I don't like, I don't, for some reason this bothers me. The, the the clean doctor's office. That was quite the sentence. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wonder how my life would have been if I... I have no idea if that was even a mechanic to know. My dreams have found their savior, a dark creature swabbed in dirty robes, now lives within them. They eat the rats and silence the screaming. Soon I will begin work. Not this filthy government's rat work, but my true work. I will give birth to my savior so they can silence everything. He sounds like a really fun guy. Great at parties. <gasps> it's his office. Or one of their office. I don't I don't I didn't actually pay attention to who wrote that note. I guess it could could be a lady. We only know doctor. Shrieks and squeals are all I hear. My dreams are infested with these rats. If only they knew they were going to make into something beautiful. If they knew that and they had the capacity to, they would respect me, but no, it's nothing but screams and wailing. I can't sleep, I can hardly think, even when I'm further away from the sound. Even when I'm further away than the sound should possibly travel, I can still hear them. Oh, okay.
I have to be extremely quiet and stealthy, chat. Lockers. What, 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 what is? Today I question the higher stuff just how far they think we can go with experiments. Dr. P Piccanini told me to hold off and brought me into one of the off-limits rooms and show showed me something I don't fully understand. Maybe he... Oh, is he? Maybe he was playing an elaborate or inappropriate prank. Piccanini told me that his other pet project and assured me that we, work we were doing is of great importance. Yeah, I don't know about that. Never trust the lockers, champ. It's always where the monsters hide. I showed Sotrius to Dr. Brundle today. He didn't know what to think. He just stared at it. Maybe he was just scared. Sotrius is moving now, but only barely. For some reason, I can't get him to function while the camera is on him or I'm all looking at him. But he changes form in between these moments. Fun. So what is this one about, chat? We've done it. I have to get out of here as soon as I can. These are not creations that should exist. I don't know if we screwed something up along the way or if this was a possible outcome. Okay, so Brundle seems to be like in the know of what the hell is this guy doing? Ooh. Okay. My dear savior is growing every day. I started stealing some of the rats from their tiny safe cages, putting them in the hole with Sotrius. At first, I wasn't sure if they would do something, but once I left and came back, the rats were gone. Only traces of the rats left were a lipstick smear of blood on Sotrius's jaw. Okay. Is this, uh... This is this is great. Love the love what you done with this office. Lab. I like that you regenerate health. I don't like that shit. Subject. I'm so paranoid. Subject Cast 3 was originally found in the wreckage of the collapsed farmhouse by a mountain survey team. It was later brought to government attention after most of the crew went missing and then granted to our lab for testing. It appears like a normal cassette tape, but has some major differences. Spectrogram displays of the audio contained do not seem to match the structure or waveform of the actual sound, but rather several images of 
American Animal Life and Trees. Some researchers who spent significant time listening to the subject have been hospitalized for mental reasons, often becoming obsessed with a fictional being known as Babygoth. Yagaloth. Okay. That's just some straight up Cthulhu shit. Elder God. Lost tape number three. Hey, I didn't miss one of the tapes. Yay. Nice. Okay, so where was that save? There it is. Check out this tape. Game saved. This one feels very SCP. Like the uh, creatures or whatever these are. Sotrius. I'm assuming is what those are. Ooh, man, this one's good. Interesting. I like these ones because it's kind of just like explore in this creepy ass space. I mean, there might be monsters. Yeah, uh-huh. Prey gives flesh. Is this, is this werewolves? Matches. Burn the idol. Interesting. There's actually a little, like, things to do in this one. Hey. Oh, maybe by the prey? Did I go this way? Hmm.
Deep fried idol. Cool. I liked that one too. I like all those. The tapes are great. That'd be a great like five bucks. Just a whole bunch of those atmospheres. Okay. Um, so I don't have lockpick still. Like an anthology? Yeah, I'd, I'd love that. More things. Ooh, these ones have stuff coming out of their backs. Turn off the water. You're wasting all the water. Okay. Read. I'm beginning to question my fellow scientists' ethics. If we could cr truly call any of this science anymore, I fear we're stumbling into something dark. And with each breakthrough, my fear grows. I don't know how they'll react when we inevitably hit a dead end with these experiments. Those are very human feet. Joe Cat! Finished catching up with a VOD and you randomized your DS3 regrets on the wind. This game has a really interesting aesthetic. Yeah, I'm, I'm really digging it. I like the little, there's these little tapes you find. And I really love those. Uh, the rest of the game has been great, but I feel like those I really enjoy. Uh, okay, I think I did all this. Holding, did I do that? I was thinking for the sub, man. Yes, I did this. Um, this. Oh, this is the doll face. I thought that was it, using the doll head on it. Is there like something else I need? Did I miss one room? Can I smash the doll head with a sledgehammer? I can't take it out of my inventory is the issue. like I need to place it somewhere. Yeah, I saw the rattling inside thing as well. Maybe did one of these the rats. More rats. It's deep. Oh, oh, I know what there was that, uh, vice grip.
Cool. That was neat. I liked that. It would have been cool to actually like have to do that for a bit. Ooh, there's a painting here now. I think it was empty before. Ah, uh, maybe not. I may have just looked at it like that. Oh. Unpleasant. The spook. Oh, oh. Mm, is this uh, Mr. Piccanini, maybe? The eyes have been eaten. No rats, I need those for a retinal scan. Jesus, what the fuck? Unity engine debug log. I'm going to bet that's an issue and not... Spooky time. I can't get out of here. The halls are full of them. They're worshipping Piccanini's messed up pet. They swarm around just like the rats. Okay, so maybe this is Brundle? Unless it isn't. Something's happening. Uh-oh. Maybe... Things are getting a little wonky. Either the game's getting meta, or I'm, I'm not supposed to have Mr. Brundle in my inventory. Nobody knows. But what I do know is the eyes have been eaten. Let's try to go in again. I don't know. It might have been... Maybe Mr. Bruno goes in the vice grip? Okay, knife is just really good. That's what that taught me, is knife is really good. I think knife is a secret weapon or something. Yeah, it definitely seems like moving towards this area over here. 
It's like I'm seeing through his eyes. Any eyes in these uh, toilets here? Wait, there was that overflowing faucet. I don't know why I'm thinking of that. Nope. Vice Grip does not care about the body of Mr. Brundle. Oh, the retina scan just open. I see. There wasn't a puzzle to begin with. So we're carrying around a dead body. We murdered a man and a whole lot of creatures that were trying to kill us, but... Uh... Oh my god! Puppy! Jesus, fuck! You're the scariest thing that's happened to me. I don't believe it. Is it really you, boy? I could pet the boy. Oh. 10 out of 10 game. Dog is about to die. What you got there? Oh. Dr. Piccanini went crazy. He attacked me in my office screaming about sacrifice. I hit him over the head and he lost consciousness. But I confirmed he's still alive. I'm going to try to get out of here and use the flood tunnels. So this is Dr. Piccanini that I have. Also, where did I read that? Oh. What do you, boy, put put it down. That's your tongue. Also. Okay. This is where you were, boy. Let's give another pet. Okay. What if we just keep petting him? He's going through the wall now. God This fucking dog Which way should I go? Can I even go this way? Why? Just hold the dog next time, man. Give me my weapons. If you take my dog, give me my weapons. Oh, that's a lot of handles. Of course it is. The ceiling's very low here. Got my weapons back. And we're back.
Oh! We dropped... We dropped him. I guess, you know, I guess we didn't need him. Yeah, I don't think that's uh, intentional spooks there. <laughs> I think that is a... Uh, something... Something needs to be a little cleaned up, maybe. Back to picking up ammo. What? What do you mean it's broken? There's no other path. Thanks for coming to the stream, everyone. Uh, that's it for us tonight. Okay, maybe the game is getting meta. <laughs> He came back to life and they just did a little like um interesting. I now I don't know. Now I don't know if it's a bug. Why why do you stand up like that? I'm almost out of here, but Piccanini's pet is in the warehouse by the emergency exit. It won't move while I'm staring at it, but I try to look away. It seems to reappear somewhere within closer radius. If someone finds this, please be careful as the creature may still be around. Okay. We're just going weeping angels time now. Are you it? Are you the creature? Just checking. I didn't choose to drop it. It dropped automatically. The save room did a spooky thing one time. It like fl it the, the the little crystal thing was a baby for like a second, and then it. Just gonna test real quick. Oh god. Who who was like this is gonna be fun. This'll be fun for the player. Nothing. Just a pile of meat. I found a missing left eye. Let's save. What the fuck did that mean?
Didn't I pick up one of the eye? He put in his left eye. I have the left eye. I can't open my inventory. I have no idea if I'm going the right way here. I'm just running. It was me all along. But I did return to the statue. Don't do this to me, Sarkon. What? No. I, I don't trust this for a second. But my dog! Uh, two and a half hours is how long I've been playing. Going in completely, like, no info. Yeah, I'm just waiting for the jump scare. Motion capture by Cousin Danger. <laughs> That's good. Good job, game. Sotrius. The need for eyes is an unquenchable hunger. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, fuck that. Yep. Did I just throw up? Yeah, I'm throwing up bugs. It's because I ate that apple. You saw him right there. He was just watching me. Now we're just home. Picked up a map of home. The power goes out on the tracks. You have to reboot the whole system in order to do that. You go to each section, turn off the breaker boxes, and come back here and restart the system. Barely be able to keep the power on, so that's all the advice I give. So I was the one who quit. Because I witnessed the girl die. This isn't how the game started. Because I'm still missing the fourth tape.
No. Relax. Oh, tape. And cups with bugs. I want to go do the tape. Wait a minute. I didn't realize there were four doors there. Mixtape player, I got an achievement! Vacancy signs flashing. Someone has poured gas all over this. Just pour the first floor, right? It's covered in bugs! Oh, those are bugs. I can't sleep here. Card and bugs. I'm a ghost. Something is sleeping here. Okay. It's wet and putrid. Can't sleep here. The bed looks clean. I could sleep here. Just a normal dryer. Just a normal dryer, chat. The look and feel of these uh, tapes are great. I know I keep saying that. Can't sleep here. The bed is coated, coated in soot. Cool. Normal for a hotel. Okay, let's try upstairs. So we have that one bed that was good. Something is holding it shut. Just, just a sentence like that can give me chills. I love that.
It's soaked with tar. Barry? What are you doing, Barry? You've come at appropriately spooky time. Okay, so I think it was just that one bedroom that we could sleep in. You're currently unsettled. How are you? Hey, that's about how I feel. Is this the one I could sleep or Try to sleep, yes. Yes. Nightmare. Mm, it's all covered in bugs again. It's covered in bugs, chat. Which one of you covered my beds in bugs? Who put fire? Something is in there. Fire. It's fire, Dan. Still soaked with tar. Can I leave? Am I stuck? I think I stuck myself, chat. Okay, hang on. Darn. Sorry, I put those bugs in your bed. Okay, let me... We know which bed to go to. So let's run to the bed. Okay. This time, I won't get stuck in the wall. Covered in bugs. I like my women like I like my coffee. Covered in bees. Hmm. Maybe we have to find another room to sleep in? Still covered in bugs. Because some stuff was different, because the washing machine was full of fire. So maybe... Sun changes into sunken and uh, I don't want to read it. This one's still creepy. This one's still covered in soot. Bars are still unnecessary. There was that one that was being held shut.
This one. It's broken now. Try to sleep. Uh, more bugs? It's filthy. Hmm. I don't like that sound. I don't want to go down the stairs again that way. I got, hang on, I'm spooked. I'm spooked, chat. I'm proper frightened. Oh, it's just a bunch of organs. Who put their organs? They were wet. I mean, that's fair. Organs are wet. Candles are out. It really wants to sleep. Oh, the uh, chair looks clean. Sleep in the chair. If it's covered in bugs again. This whole room's gross. Everything's gross now. Oh, Jesus! Scared the shit out of me, game. I didn't know there was going to be spooks in those. Well, let's save. We, we've done the tapes. Okay, that was clearly the coolest tape because there was a thing in it. Um, now we're back to this hell of I don't know what's real anymore. We had a credit scene and everything chat. It's stuck. Of course it is. It's rusted shit. Yep. Okay. We're back here. Everything's great. Can't hear my puppy. Spooky Stories for Kids, Volume 1. Once there lived a nasty old man in a nasty old house. The nasty old man wouldn't go outside. The nasty old man wouldn't play. He sat in his tub and soaked in the water all day. Just him and his music, enjoying the water, even though it was nasty and green. He soaked all day, every night, but he never tried to get clean. But one day, the old man couldn't find his music. His radio was all filled with static. 
He twisted and turned and tried all the stations and things got a little dramatic. His radio fell down in the water and he missed the off switch. And the story goes that if you visit his house, his nasty old corpse will still twitch. It rhymed, and I just wasn't doing it. Sorry. I just realized it was rhyming. I was just telling it like a kid's spooky story. Oh, good. A uh, this. What are you hoping to what? accomplish? Without me, you're just hollow. You're pathetic. You need fear to motivate you. Is that my brain? Did I just destroy my brain? Is this Dark Souls? What is going on? What is with this thing? Bug. Okay. Okay, the, no, 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 I don't want to play anymore. I've decided not to play anymore, chat. I've decided I don't want to play ever again, chat. Oh my god. It's blocked. What the fuck? <gasps> Jesus! What do you what? Game over. You didn't outrun the giant thing that was way bigger than you and kills you. You silly. Was this door here? Yeah, this is me. This is home. What if I just never leave? Okay, so clearly we have to figure out where to lead this guy. Because the pathway was blocked. And I, I couldn't kill this maybe maybe go through here but this is where I was oh, okay, okay hang on we got to go down each of these paths now he hit me like once and I died Is he too big to like fit down one of these pathways or something? Okay, read the note. I know this sucks, but... Okay, cutscene's gonna happen. Maybe don't kill that thing. I guess I could try that. I don't know if this switch does anything.
Oh, the kid's story was the key. Oh, fuck this. I'm gonna save. Spooky Stories for Kids, Volume 2. Once there lived a nice man with his nice old dog. The nice man was content, just him and his dog. Watching the years pass by, his house was old, and deep in the woods with a little bo blue patch of sky. This one doesn't rhyme. <laughs> one night, the nice old man... I, I just gave him... He's old now. The nice man was walking his dog, as was his healthy habit. Nightly habit. But then the dog got out of his leash, quickly chased after a rabbit. The night sky was dark, just barely lit, so the nice man was filled with worry. But then the dog, but then the old dog yelped and ran inside as if he was in a hurry. Oh, there it does rhyme. I, I suck at this. <laughs> the nice man went inside and locked up, his worries for now put to bed. But then out of the window he saw his old dog, but its skin had been shed. Skin had been shed. So we got a deagle of something. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Do you think you're getting better? Does doing this even have a purpose? I'm the dog! Holy shit, it's hard to turn. I don't know what that noise was. Why am I so unnerved?
I don't understand. Was that not my dog? I'm just gonna save. I'm just gonna save. I don't know. I don't know what's going happening anymore, chat. I'm just scared. Well, we've, we've gotten 30 extra minutes of gameplay out of this from when I originally thought the game was fucking over. <laughs> oh, Will. Hello, sir. I'm scared. I think Will has finished it because he streamed it a long time ago. Which I, uh... Wish I knew. Oh, is this going to be another weak, weeping angel shit? There's the restroom. Anyone need to go? Anyone need to go, chat? Before we go, I don't want to pull over, chat. Mmm, I don't like how uh, twisty this place is. One. Oh, okay. We got it. Spooky Stories for Kids, Volume 3. Once there lived a great old beast in a great old wood. The great old beast would attack the town and carry young children away. It screamed and it howled from inside the woods each night and every day. So one night the townsfolk hatched a plan to slay the beast once and for all. They snuck up close while it slept under a tree and then they made it fall. It growled and hissed, not moving an inch since the fallen tree held it down. The warriors fought and stabbed the old beast and finally saved the town. But the stories go that if you visit the woods that under a great fallen oak, the great old beast isn't dead at all. He just hasn't woke. Okay. Ah. Uh. Something, I gotta like throw a switch and pin something, maybe. I'm your identity. No, you're not. But I didn't see a switch, is what I'm scared of. Jesus Christ, I don't want to look. Should I look, chat? Oh, fuck me. Um... Porter Chase. <laughs> okay. Uh, so did I... Okay, maybe I needed to... I see the cat yet? No, but I... The one, like, thing that I was watching uh, 
when uh, Vinny was playing was that he shot a cat and immediately died. That's the only thing I knew going into this game. Okay, so I run, and run, and then I think I just stayed straight. Is that what I did? And then I turned, and then I turned. This seemed right, okay. Is there maybe... Not another set of buttons here. But maybe I should just do that and then run around. Hmm. So I maybe trap it and then continuously do that again and again? Not sure. Yeah, attacking with the knife while I was holding the door was a thought, too. Jesus Christ, that shit's terrifying. I went the wrong way. Gotta have the jukes, chat! What happened? I think I was too slow, too fast. Yeah, I got past. How the fuck do I get out of here? Shit, I just made a fucking loop. No. Safe. <sighs> the hell, man.
Oh, not my house anymore. Uh... Oh, well, looks like we're not going back that way. No? Are you leading me to scares, bug? Normal. Why bugs? No more bugs. I just want dog. What did I just say? Dead. Fucking bugs kill me. Why are you giving me more ammo? I thought I was done. Kitchen knife is best friend. Kitchen friend. Kitchen knife is the only friend I need in this world.
Excuse me. What the, the fuck? Okay, everything's... That's normal. That's normal, right, chat? Things hunky dory over here, nothing terrifying. Which one, my dog? That's one, my dog chat. What is this? No. I want to check that door. I wonder if I was carrying that baby this whole time. I wonder if I could have given it the baby. Where you at? Where you at, turd?
Can I go read this note? The text is illegible. Great! Oh, sorry. It, it wasn't no commentary. I just... That was a, a, a tense moment. My boy! Stop! There's an open sewer there, you idiot. Don't <laughs> scare me like that. Can we go? Are we happy boy? How'd you get up here? Good end. You escape the confines of the sewer and reunite with your dog. You feel that your experience has changed who you are and that the barriers of life that once restricted and intimidated you have now fallen away. You've been to hell and back, confronted your fears, and gotten stronger. I have so many questions. Like, I shouldn't have killed that baby. Dog handling. <laughs> the dog's name was Danny. I don't like this backup dogs. The talking brain, Christian Miles. Amazing people raised. Oh, that's great. Are these all the people who raised money? Any names I recognize? There's a Daniel! <laughs> Hot cross. This was great. I'm just waiting till the end. They already teased me one time. Feeling safe instead of feeling that you can feel. Why you gotta say that to me, game? If you kill the giant white boy with the crush crush, you leave and go back there and get a present. Oh. 
Because I killed Giant. I killed the boy. I just want to, like... Look at, like, the wiki. Like, what did the baby do? What did that baby do, Chant? Here's Sotrius. Sotirius, or however you say his name. Mysterious entity created by Dr. Piccanini. The purpose of being his savior, the creature was given life and nourishing him, and then blah, blah, blah. It's unclear how Sotirius was created, but the evidence points to a combination of scientific testing. Um... Sotiris first appears briefly in the mines, which teleports quickly away after being spotted. I saw that, and I was like, what the hell is that? First encountered as an enemy after opening a door that leads to a warehouse. If the player gets too close, Sotiris will break their neck and cutscene will play, which rats eat the player's corpse, starting with their eyes. In order to escape the laboratories, the player needs to collect one of the eyes from a fleshy pile. Shortly after, Sotiris is inserting an eye into his one of his eye holes. From then on, the Sotiris says, I will always look at the player... Though it could still cannot move, during the segment, the player needs to get the door locked by the retinal scanner to reach the elevator. Wow, I just did that, like, first instinct. Go. Uh, the elevator, after escaping surgery, has fake credits begin to roll. It will continue. The elevator cord breaks, sending the player plummeting. Surgery's final appearance happens during the sequence where it's briefly seen hanging on the elevator door before the player reaches the final area of the game. I saw that. Nightmare ending. At the end of the sewers where you would get the hand gun in the full game, you'll be prompt. Oh, yeah, it's gonna do its thing. Let's do this so it goes back. Um, three options. At the end of the sewers where you would get the hand gun in the full game, you'll be prompt with three. What? I never, I never had this choice. So is that that other pathway that I went down? Because there was like, there was a moment in the game where I saw like dog silhouette and then there was a pathway and I went to the dog and then like it went to a loading screen. So if I go that, that other way, that was an option for a bad end. Good ending, escape with the dog. At the end of the game, after choosing to go down the demonic tunnel instead of leaving the sewers and going through an area full of creatures, the player finds themselves in a hallway that progressively fades to white. The player goes back to completely normal sewer, finding their dog outside of the sewers. At the start of the game, you can just spam E on the ladder and you will get this ending exactly as you kill the dog ending without killing your dog. At the end of the game, after choosing to abandon the dog and leave the sewers, instead of going through a demonic tunnel, the player simply leaves the sewers, however, without their dog, and the screen fades. Okay, so that was when I heard the dog bark and I turned and went that other path.
Dead dog ending in the second completely demonic zone of the sewer entrance just before entering Lost Type 1. The player can go to the hallway to the right. Grab the damage shotgun, shotgun or damage handgun, then attempting to shoot the dog shadow at the end of the hallway ends in the player being teleported to the sewer exit. However, leaving the player's dog lies on the ground saying negative things when interacted with and a while later the screen fading. Oh no. First the player needs to bring back bring the corpse stuck picketing to Sotria. Secondly, after killing the siren what the heck is the siren? Oh, okay. Um, you must leave the area and go back later to retrieve a child's skull from the corpse of the siren. Lastly, place the child's skull in the tree-looking entity. The player leaves the stores after triggering the event. However, after leaving, the player discovers the city is filled with screams and sirens. Sends completely locked to everything being read. Neat! Okay. That baby you killed was a parasite that would kill you. Really? Interesting. Interesting, chat. Hmm. I wish I could see that parasite thing happen. Grand Poulin. Okay. Um, how do I... Locations, I guess, maybe? Explore. Am I the only one who doesn't know how to find pages on Wikipedia, like, uh, on Wikia? I just have to, like, guess. No idea how to find stuff here. Uh, game mechanics locations? Oh, there we go. Alright, where is it? The train mimic was one of the coolest enemies. I loved that. Huh. Interesting that the thing will kill you. I'm curious how that uh, takes place. Dang, this game was great, guys. Uh, thank you for hanging with me. Um, yeah, I'll message you, Will. Because, uh, this was great. Um, we'll, we'll pick up, uh, doing that, the first chapter of Visage, um, some point this week. Um, I, I reinstalled it on a different drive, because I realized it was still installed on my C drive, where, like, all my shit is, but I have a SSD drive that I've been trying to put all my Steam games on, 
So hopefully that'll help. Um, and because I really want to show you guys some stuff in that because it is so good. Like, hot dang. Uh, I mean, even the one, the, the mirror one that we were doing was fun. Uh, it was just a little slower paced. Um, maybe because I didn't know it as well. Um, but yeah. Thank you all for hanging. This was great. Lost in Vivo. It's like, it was like 10 bucks. I highly recommend. Uh, it looks like there's a lot more to it uh, as well. Um, but yeah. Have yourselves a great night. I think people are still streaming. This is... I feel like I'm ending pretty early. Is anyone still on? Rena's still on! Oh, yes! Rena's playing uh, uh, the little town hero. I think. Hang on. Dang it, she literally just ended. And she's about to raid me. Damn it. <laughs> well... <laughs> Here, I'm, I'll, I'll put on her, uh... I really don't know much M Many other people. <laughs> I just have... bigger streamers. And I have Dan, who I guess is. Hey man, how you doing? I have, Good to see you. I'm uh, we're like we're just about to end. <laughs> That's like it. Octo too, yeah, because he's always on late. Uh, well, it's good to see you. Uh, Thanks for coming by. Yeah, this was great. Uh, if fair. you haven't played Lost of Evo, <laughs> I recommend. Let's just read Cole. He's playing Destiny. I don't know about Destiny. Cool. We'll raid we'll raid Cole. I'm just gonna I'm gonna follow okay. suit with what we just doing. Awesome. Stop, Vivo. Really appreciate it. Good night, good night. <clears throat> Alright. Uh let's go let's go raid them. I don't I don't even know what they're playing. We'll find out together chat they're playing destiny too all right thank you everyone uh let's go let's go raid yeah see y'all <laughs> heck need arena thank you so much for the raid hello everyone oh my goodness wait 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 Uh, did we just get a double raid? What? Uh, Dan Jones, uh, Rena, thank you so much for the raids. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Goodbye, VOD watchers. Uh, heck. <laughs>